Hi guys! Today on Divas and Cook, we are making a ton of bacon, some garlic and onions, and creating one amazing pot of black eyed peas to bring in the new year. Now my voice is still jacked up, you guys, okay? So bear with me, but hey, I'll take it because I have not had a voice in like three weeks. What? Let's get right into this recipe. Okay, so we're gonna start by chopping up a whole lot of bacon. I like a lot of bacon in my black eyed peas. So I chopped up a lot. We're gonna throw this into our hot pan. I'm so glad to be back, you guys. I miss you guys so, so much. Oh my God. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and just fry this up. Now, I like my bacon to be like kind of burnt, you know what I'm saying? I like it nice and all crispy and stuff. So yeah, I kind of burn mine just a little bit, just like that. Now I have another black IP recipe on my blog um, that uses smoke. Um, turkey leg so if that's your thing you can check out that video go ahead and drain that bacon on some paper towels just like that it was smelling so divine oh my gosh I love love bacon okay so I'm gonna leave a little bit of that grease in my pan because we're gonna add some onions a whole bunch of onions because yeah that's how I like it but you don't have to add that much if you don't want to okay then go ahead and just fry these onions up until they are nice and translucent and smelling all lovely like this right here Oh, perfect and then we're gonna add in a little bit of garlic or a whole lot of garlic if that's the way you like it we're gonna cook this garlic until it is all fragrant and your kitchen is smelling all divine and then we're gonna set this aside place it in a little bowl or something there's nothing like onions cooked in bacon fat oh my god so good so good okay so now we're gonna move on to our black eyed peas I have soaked these bad boys overnight you can do overnight you can do a quick soak according to the package you know just read the back of the package and it'll tell you how to quick soak them for an hour or you can just like, you know, don't soak them at all, but you might get gassy. I have another recipe on my blog that I did not soak the beans in. They were just fine, but yeah, if you're gassy, you gotta soak them. Okay, I add them to the pot, then we're gonna add in some chicken broth. Make sure you use chicken broth. Don't use no water. Mm -mm. We want flavor, flavor, flavor. Chicken broth is like the bomb. There's my onions and my garlic going in. And a little bit of red pepper flakes because I like it a little spicy. Go ahead and stir this on up. We're gonna bring this to a boil, okay? Then we're gonna throw in my little bay leaf. Get in there, Bailey. For all you, there you are, just like that. And then we're gonna cover it up, and we're gonna cook it for about 20 to 30 minutes, just until it is tender, depending on the texture you like. I like for my beans to still hold their shape, but I like them to be nice and soft. Okay, so I usually do about 20 minutes, and then I'll turn the heat off and just let it sit for about you know 10 or so, and then it's perfect like that. Okay, so I took out the bay leaf. I'm gonna add my bacon because I'm ready to serve this right now. Normally, I don't add this bacon until I'm ready to serve it, but I'm gonna serve up this entire pot right now to my guests. So yeah, dump that bacon on in there. And then I use like a low sodium um, chicken broth. So I'm gonna add in lots and lots of black pepper, and we're gonna finish it off with some smoked salt. Mm -hmm, that smoked salt just really adds so much smoke in it, so it is so good. But yeah, so this is it right here. We are done. I'm glad because I'm so over my voice right now. Like, I hate it. I sound so nasty. I'm gonna add in a lot of um, parsley as well. Since I didn't use any celery or um, bell pepper, green bell pepper, the parsley gives it a nice little, you know, punches of green and make it beautiful. Now, when you serve it, you have to add some what? Hot sauce. Yes, you guys like hot sauce on your black eyed peas. Like, I have to have hot sauce and cornbread. What are you talking about? But yeah, go ahead and dig in. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification so you'll know whenever I post new videos. Thanks for watching. Later.